Hey. Hi, how are you? How are you doing? Yeah, good. Kurt Schroeder. <laughs> nice meeting you. And uh, so, how was the show for you? Good? It was a fantastic show for us. We invested a lot of money into our booth, but it turns out that really did attract a lot of people. We did a lot of process development for people during the show using all of our shape uh, pulse technology. And it, it, it's really a repeat of what we absolutely do in the laboratory, but we did it right here at the show. And it saved a lot of our customers a lot of time. And they can come here and see the results right in front of them. It's really tough to get people to actually come to your facility. But to have people come all here together and see the machinery working and having all these live demos it convinced people of the reality of it that this wasn't just pipe dreams, it wasn't vaporware, it was a real thing. So we were uh, had R&D systems, and in addition to R&D systems, we had all of our simulation technology being displayed. And then finally at the end, we had one of our production machines making uh, small piano keyboards at the rate of about 250 feet per minute, which was several hundred keyboards per minute. They could actually plug into a little zip connector and you could play a little song with it. So it was very inexpensive and very high speed processing, showing people that this technology was actually real. It wasn't um, in the future, it was now. Right. Good, good. And, uh, and so the machines you were showing, they were, they were the small ones or the big ones? I mean, uh, and, um, you, you're actually making the, the big ones and you're usually yes. showing the small ones. Here. Yes. Well, we make both. And uh, the small ones are to get people started, it's to get your fingers in the water, your, your toes in the water. And uh, that allows you to be able to specify all the process conditions and the, uh, what you uh, would need to have in a really large industrial system without having to take a big risk and buy a large industrial system. So the, the small systems you can do all the R&D on because they use uh, the same lamps and the same drivers as the really large systems. And when you spec out the, the, uh, uh, the conditions on the R&D system, you can know exactly what you need to do on the big system. The nice thing about doing that is that when you also have large systems in production and you need to change conditions because you might have to uh, uh, have a, a new type of a print job with a different type of a film you need to process, you don't have to do your R&D on that really big multi-million dollar system that's supposed to be making you money. What you can do is you can do the R&D on the R&D system and it can be in another country and once you develop those conditions, we can email them immediately to all the machines. Yeah. So we're doing this right now where we do R&D on one system and we have multiple machines in production actually in many places in the world in many different countries and we email those to the, all the machines in all the other countries and there's no downtime on the production systems. Tell us a little bit more about you know, when, when people come to you, like mm -hmm. potential customers, what are their biggest problem when they, they come to you? Is it, is it just, just a curing problem or they, they've got more than that? It's usually more than that. Sometimes they think it's one particular problem but with, when they realize that we don't offer just one particular solution. We, we occupy uh, almost all portions of the printed electronics value supply chain. Uh, we Sometimes we, we will just sell people inks, sometimes we're selling people curing equipment, sometimes we're integrating it all together, mm -hmm. and uh, it, it really depends upon what the customer wants. We actually let them drive it, but we help them develop their processes. And we're very, very patient. Some of our customers will work with us for two or three years before they pay us a penny, but at the end they end up basically going with us because uh, we're trustworthy, we're competent, and we're very high science, and we offer a solution to their problems. Okay, great. Thank well, you. Thanks again for coming to the show. I hope to see you next year. Appreciate it. Thanks. Yeah. Have a great day. Yeah.